back here at home tonight at 5 o'clock. It has been one year since an Indianapolis family learned the body of their loved one was found in another state. They've not stopped looking for answers since her murder. Our crime beat reporter Steve Jefferson tonight spoke with the family about how they're now bringing attention to this case on the one-year anniversary. The family of Adolph Hunter shared with me the same public plea today that they shared a year ago. Please help bring his killer to justice. From the first interview, I've told you, we are not giving up. Sharon Hunter talked to 13 News about her family's determination to find answers in her brother's 2019 homicide. Last May, police in Preble County, Ohio, called after finding the body of Adolph Hunter, seen in these photos shared by the family. Your sister told me that he liked to take pictures, too. Is that right? Yeah, he liked to take pictures and dance. He was kind of like the family clown. Hunter's body was found 80 miles away on May 22nd, 2019, but investigators believe he was killed in Indianapolis near East 19th Street, not far from Rule. You're really trying to cover up something if you take a person out of town, you know, and for you to ride with him for two hours, you have to have a very harsh soul. And one year later, near 21st and Rule, the Crime Stoppers billboard about Hunter's murder is still up, visible to everybody in the neighborhood. That has to be a blessing from God because normally uh, they would have taken the billboard down or when our time was up for the time that we paid for, the people were generous enough to leave it up there, and I want to give thanks to them, whoever they are. If you have any information on Adolph Hunter's case, call Crime Stoppers. You can call anonymously at 317-262-TIPS.